Hello, hello. This episode from Padang Bay. Padang Bay. Locals say Padang Bay. Um, this is a place where we starting our trip to Nusa Penida, our boat trip to Nusa Penida for manta rays, for drift dives. It takes about one hour, I don't know, maybe, maybe one hour, 20 minutes to get here from Ahmed and then another hour to Manta Point. Uh, what else is in interesting here is there are many dive centers, so many people offering snorkeling tours. Not so far from here is the Blue Lagoon, which is really popular for snorkeling. Also some dive sites around here. From here you can go to uh, Chandidasa dive sites, Tepekong and those places. To that side there's not so many dive sites, but what is in my plan for the future, I really want to dive. There is a Pertamina base where they bring from another places the petrol is where they separate where all the big tracks bring this petrol so that's there and there is a really good jetty and as you know under the jetties there are always something really interesting to see so that's my plan the reason I came here is actually um, we are going to Lombok soon in a couple of weeks and I want to find ferry in internet, internet is not the strongest here, not so many websites. Uh, if you have personal contacts, that's easy, easier to find uh, information than if you just type in, let's say, Padang by Lambar ferry. There is some public ferries, there are no fast boats, it's about five hours to go there. But anyway, so I came personally here, girls went for shopping to South and uh, I'm going to figure out what is the price, when it goes, how many times a day. So that's my plan. Everybody's just talking about the jetty and everybody's saying it's amazing, those who've been diving there. But I'm not really sure is that one or yeah, definitely, definitely not this one. I think there is the security who's guarding all that thing from all the diversions. But that one looks say still building and uh, most probably that's the one I, I was planning to dive. Banja. Or maybe something different. Looks some pretty impressive. Big building. Fence is just incredible. 
And that's the jetty. Maybe it's a good idea to fly here. But the beach is kind of it's grayish. Dude. Solid, nice, grayish. It's like a kind of mixed white with a black. Super dirty. I don't think you will enjoy if you will come to this beach, but it's it's not really a touristic place, it's all fishermen villages. Looks like a nice place for the beach walks and I'm um, pretty sure it was the idea was because the first of all this is a wave breaker uh, protecting all the coastline here uh, many villas are located around here and that's it you cannot really walk further just simply because there are villas all right Let's fly then! This is the first time I'm here. I didn't know about this place. Another spot. Nice place to take a rest if you're going to Ahmed. Just come down to this parking place really nice with some swings along the coastline here there are no any beaches uh, there are only these wave breakers we'll go to the place where we usually loading for Chandidasa dives and we'll fly from there here is nothing really to show so all these stones and nothing really absolutely nothing people say there was a beautiful beach in Chandidasa previously and then some 20 years ago there was a really strong storm and it brought all the sand away from the beach and now it's like it is most probably this is the only place where some sand is still left and uh, everyone who's in Chandidasa if you're looking for the like I don't know you cannot do really any beach walks here because it's too narrow and there are so many boats but you still can be on a beach 
if you want. All right, let's fly a little bit around here and have to find some shed. It is it's an incredible place. I love the color of the water and I love that combination with the sand. It's, it's beautiful. Yeah. Place is beautiful, and uh, for the information, the distance to the Mimpang, which looks really close from the shore, is actually a little bit more than a kilometer. I think 1.1 kilometer. I have, a, I said that distance range limit for one kilometer, and I wasn't able to really reach it all right that's it for today thank you very much for watching follow subscribe don't be lazy like also don't be lazy and see you on the next one bye